Eastern News. It's rude, it's crude, and it's so immature. Well, there's three good reasons. <laughs> I mean, Christy, you're just not getting it. South American life. Yeah, you... American life. Yeah, you're missing the sophisticated humor here. Get your back butt out of my face. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, much too sophisticated for uh... me. <laughs> All right, the pizza's here. No, 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 you sit here and rest your name. You didn't get the door. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Michael, since when do you work for Captain Hook's Pizza? Since three days ago. Well, why didn't you tell us? Look at me. Oh. <laughs> yeah, the man's got a point. <laughs> I banged up my dad's Lexus. It's gonna cost me 2,000 bucks to fix it. 2,000 bucks? That's how much my grandma costs. <laughs> oh, it's a long story. <laughs> anyway, if I don't get it fixed before he gets home from his business trip, I'm so dead meat. Mm, couldn't be much worse than wearing that hat. <laughs> yeah, cute. <laughs> Look, it's bad enough to pay bites, and I have to work till midnight. But I get bagged on by every jerk who orders pizza. Uh, look on the bright side, Mike. Oh, right. You can't see the bright side because of that patch. <laughs> Michael's in a jam and he's trying to do the right thing. He deserves our support. Thank you, Christy. Here's your pizza. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> you gotta say it. <laughs> Ahoy, matey. Here's a pizza that'll shiver your timbers. Ah, right. <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> Coach, doing a little shopping? Ooh, what'd you buy me? It's not for you. Oh. It's for me. It's, uh... Oh, no, 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 don't tell me. I am the queen of shopping. I can tell it's in any package without even opening it. May I? Humor her. Hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, too easy. It's a Star Master Baby Hubble Telescope with an 8-inch reflector and... Ooh, Coach, you sprung for the optional camera mount. How'd you do that? Oh, it's a gift. You're either born with it or you're not. Mm -hmm. And she wrote a little label there on the box. <laughs> Coach, since when are you into astronomy? Ever since I was a kid. I always loved just looking up at the night sky. You know, just being alone with the stars helps me to relax. Oh, relaxation is everything. There's so much stress out there. I mean, everywhere you look, stress, stress, stress. Personally, I blame the media. It's an awful... Is there a button that turns her off? <laughs> Cool, you have a hobby. I'll tell you what's really cool. A week from Friday night, something's gonna happen that only happens once in a hundred years. You got a date? <laughs> Ignoring you. I'm talking about the Verflagen Comet. The what? It was discovered by Baron Claus Verflagen. This will be my only chance to see it up close. Can't wait to get home and set this baby up. <laughs> Ciao. <laughs> wow. Coach is actually happy. Oh. That's another thing that only happens once every hundred years. <laughs> Ooh. That's what my brother in that game. You guys were so lucky. You're lucky you're not on our team. Hey, well, good thing about these Saturday pickup games is winners by lunch. <laughs> not today. I got to get down to Captain Hooks. <laughs> oh, yeah. Brock, body want a paycheck. <laughs> Fucking here, boy. Fucking <laughs> here. Good game, Mike. Hey, thanks, Mr. Morgan. You play pretty well yourself. Hey, once a tornado, always a tornado. No way. You played for Deering? 1972 city champs. High score on the court. And with the 
cheerleaders? Hey, pretty impressive. And that whole champ thing, too. <laughs> Stick with basketball. You've got a big future. Thanks, man. I hope you're right. I know I am. You up for a little one-on-one? -on -one? I can't. I gotta go deliver pizzas for Captain Hook. Delivering pizzas? That's no job for the star of the tornado. Yeah, tell me about it. But I wrecked my dad's car and I gotta make some quick cash. I'll tell you what. I could use some help around my offices. I'll pay you 15 an hour and you don't have to wear the eye patch. Whoa, 15 bucks an hour? Are you serious? Yeah, we'll get you out of that jam, put a few bucks in your pocket. Oh, man, that's really nice of you. Hey, I need the help. You need the job. We're both winners. Man, this is great. I can't wait to get right over there and quit. Here, save yourself a trip. Hey, Antonio, can I ask you a favor? Sorry, Coach. I'm out of Mr. Bubble. <laughs> Not bad. I need to borrow your window. Truth is, it's the best place in the whole house to watch the for flag and combat. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, a telescope. I always want to look through one of these babies. <laughs> well, forget it. This is a very delicate, expensive piece of equipment, and I don't want your dirty fingers all over it. They're not dirty. Anymore. <laughs> Come on, coach. It's educational. You're not going to stop me from learning, are you? Okay, whiny puss. Just look. Don't touch. <laughs> Oh, wow. That's amazing. Impressive, huh? <laughs> yeah, and if she takes off that robe, it'll even be more impressive. Get away. <laughs> you can't look into someone's window. That's illegal. Oh, great. And I just bought a brand new pair of binoculars. <laughs> okay, I gotta go. Now, I don't want anybody near my telescope. No looking through it. No touching. No walking near it. <laughs> hey, coach. No time. <laughs> hey, Michael. <laughs> What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be working? I gave Captain Hook the hook. I quit. Oh, but how are you going to pay to get your dad's car fixed? Well, you know that guy I play basketball with, Mr. Morgan? He gave me a job at his real estate office. Morgan Realty? They sold us our house. We have a little magnet with his picture on the fridge. Oh, it's really cute. <laughs> anyway, he's really great. He's paying me 15 bucks an hour, and all I got to do is pick up some keys, put up some sold signs, and answer the phone. Sweet, man. You're going to get your dad's car fixed in no time. It's already in the shop. Mr. Morgan lent me the money to fix it. Two thousand bucks? Michael, who is this guy? Oh, he's Santa Claus. Right? <laughs> and he's landed on Mikey's roof with the big sack of cash. Sounds almost too good to be true. I know. I'm not lucky or what. Come quickly. Ah, I got this one. I gotta break this fitty anyway. Ooh, look at Mikey making the cake and flashing it around. <laughs> I'm actually making money right sitting in this booth. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, there's another 20. Ooh. <laughs> that was cool. We've got this pager and the guy calls him when he meets. Which is like never. He called once all week, and that was to take me to an Indiana Tech game. Hmm? Seats on the floor. No! <laughs> I better go. I have a geometry test. Wait a minute. I'm in that class. How come I don't have a geometry test? Uh-oh. Sorry. Right. You coming, Julie? I'll catch up with you guys. Thing everywhere. Neutrogena's clear? My skin looks... Okay. Okay, what is it? You've got that pinched, I'm really annoyed look on your face. Make that... Well, I didn't want to say this in front of everybody, but I talked to some people about Mr. Morgan. Did you know he's an alumni booster for Indiana Tech? So? Michael, I... I think he's doing all the stuff because he wants you to play ball for his school. Okay, one more time. So? I like Indiana Tech. I think about going there. Well, yeah, but... Passing it around. <laughs> I'm actually making money right now, sitting in this booth. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah, there's another 20. Ooh! <laughs> that was unbelievable. He's got this pager and the guy calls him when he needs. Which is like never. He called once all week and that was to take me to an Indiana Tech game. Hmm? Seats on the floor. Oh, no! <laughs> Well, I better go. I have a geometry test. Wait a minute. I'm in that class. How come I don't have a geometry test? Uh-oh. <laughs> you coming, Julie? I'll catch up with you guys. Okay, okay. Okay, what is it? You've got that pinched, I'm really annoyed look on your face. Well, I didn't want to say this in front of everybody, but I talked to some people about Mr. Morgan. Did you know he's an alumni booster for Indiana Tech? So? Michael, I, I think he's doing all the stuff because he wants you to play ball for his school. Okay, one more time. So? 
I like Indiana Tech. I think about going there. Well, yeah, but if you take money from somebody recruiting for a school, you can get in big trouble. You know, like thrown off the team or banned from playing college ball. Look, Julie, it's not like that, okay? Mr. Morgan's just a, a friend who's doing something really nice for me. But you hardly know him. Besides, what kind of friend does something that could mess up your whole future? Look, all I know is I gotta fix my dad's car now, okay? And this is a way to do it. And, and besides, Mr. Morgan hasn't said one thing to me about going to Indiana Tech. Fine. Do what you want. Fine, I will. He went home? Good, he's not here. Hey, come on in. <laughs> oh, Mike, I think it's so sweet of you to rent a place to one of the players. Well, sweet is what I do best. <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you want to show me? What I want to show you? Oh, I got a new telescope. I want you to try it. <laughs> Ooh, it's a beauty. Put your baby blues right there and get ready for a real treat. Oh, wow. Everything looks so beautiful. <laughs> I'll say. <laughs> oh, here, I'll get it. I'll get it. Is that better? I'll say. <laughs> Is it going to be all right? Oh. Ah, oh, jeez. I got to get this fixed by tomorrow night or I'm going to miss the for flogging comment. <laughs> language. <laughs> oh, man. Ooh. Too bad Mikey's not here. He paid for all this. Hey, since he got that new job, my wife's been having one fine vacation. Aloha. <laughs> hey, coach isn't home. I wonder if that lady is, though. <laughs> Eugene, don't mess with coach's telescope, right? Relax, I'm just gonna look through it. Well, be careful. Guys, guys! What? The lens is cracked. Now what'd oh, you do? Nothing, I mean, I barely touched it. I just looked through well, it. Only you can break something just looking through it. Look, <laughs> <laughs> yep, it's cracked. This is great. Coach is gonna freak when he finds out we broke his telescope. What do you mean, we? <laughs> I didn't touch it. Well, we've gotta get it fixed or we're dead. I'm out of here. Eugene, running away has never solved anything. Oh, great. I'll be sure to think about that when I'm running down the block. <laughs> oh, you have the lens? Great. Can't hold it for Katowinski. Oh, K A T. You know, we'll get there faster than I can spell it. So, did they have it? They have one left. Great. Give me your keys. <laughs> right. Come on. My car's in the shop. I finally got my seats adjusted precisely where I want them. And in case you haven't noticed, we're not exactly the same size. I'll try. Fine. Michael, take over practice. Come on. Did you think about what I said? Julie, I already told you, even if Mr. Morgan is a recruiter, he's not recruiting me. He's just trying to help me out. Michael, how can you not see this? Listen to Julie, man. I mean, something's off with that Morgan guy. You told everybody? Uh, no, she just told us. I told everybody. <laughs> what? Look, Michael, don't blame Julie. She's just worried about you like the rest of us. Well, quit worrying, you guys. I'm fine. Well, let's play some ball. Michael, you're taking a big chance, man. Look, even if I am, it's my problem. Just chill. <laughs> chill? Oh, that's our team captain's big advice. Chill. Oh, that's why. And we'll be in the corner getting chilly. <laughs> Eugene is right. If you get thrown off the team, that's our problem. No. No, no. The only problem here is you guys getting into my business. Hey, Mr. Morgan, thanks for coming. Yeah, you want to talk to me about something? Uh, yeah. Uh, look, you've been doing a lot of really nice things for me lately, and uh, I really appreciate it. What are friends for? Yeah, well, 
This is really embarrassing. <laughs> You're gonna laugh when you hear this, man. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm really bad at that. Um, look, my friends think the only reason you're trying to help me out is because you want me to go play for Indiana Tech. What? Have I ever been talked to you about Tech? You're right. That was really stupid. But you did ask me to a game. Sure. And I took my mother-in-law, too. But I don't want her playing for Tech. So you do recruit for Tech, don't you? Michael, when I see a player that I think is really special, I try to hook him up, sure. Tech is my alma mater. I want to see great players on that team. Isn't it against the rules for somebody like you to give me a great job and like, all that cash? Not if you don't get caught. I knew this was too good to be true. Everybody tried to tell me so, but I just wouldn't listen. You got a good deal here, Mike. Relax, buddy. You don't want to blow this one. Look, I'm sorry, Mr. Morgan, but I can't do this anymore. Whoa. Are you pulling out? I thought we had an understanding. Well, I, I guess we don't, because this has got to stop. Well, it's a little late for that. You took my money. Instead of talking about the rules, we should be talking about how you owe me. Eugene, I mean, how long does it take to buy a telescope lens? Get here already, get here already, get here already. Yeah, okay, Silk, that's not gonna get Eugene here any sooner. Oh, Eugene's here. <laughs> get me a date with Brandy, get me a date with Brandy, get me a date with Brandy. <laughs> Finally, I mean, Coach is gonna get here any minute. Give me the lens. I didn't get it. What? I drove all over looking for one. What can I say? This is not an astronomy town. Now what? <laughs> well, running's looking really good right now, huh? Oh, you better run fast. Coach is coming up the stairs. Oh, I, 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 oh. <laughs> Tell me again why I should be excited about this comet thing. Julie, this is the only chance in our lifetime to see a comet this big, so close to Earth. Well, how close will it be? 60 million miles. Oh, well, you sure let me know when it's coming so I can duck. <laughs> Yo, Coach, what's shaking? <laughs> it's comet time. Hey, where's my telescope? <gasps> it's gone. I can see that. What'd you guys do with it? Nothing. You told us not to touch it, not even to look at it. So while we weren't looking at it, somebody must have stolen it. <laughs> I can't believe I'm gonna miss my comet. Don't worry, Coach. I'm sure it'll be on TV. TV? Why don't you just draw a picture and throw it over my head? <laughs> Achoo! <gasps> Someone's in the closet. <laughs> you found me. All right, your turn. One Mississippi, two Mississippi. <laughs> Give me that. Well, what's going on? Well, the other day Eugene looked through your telescope and kind of cracked the lens. <laughs> you know, wacky me. <laughs> you didn't break the lens. I did. You did it? Oh, great. Now you can just yell at yourself. <laughs> and he just bought a new lens. 10% off with his Radio Shack VIP card. <laughs> so does this mean you're not mad at me? No more than usual. <laughs> Come on, help me set this baby up. for coach. Cookies in the shape of comet. <laughs> well, if it isn't the poppin' fresh queer girl. <laughs> oh, nice shirt. We have a hole in it. Uh, <laughs> it's open. Hurry, come in. Uh, did any of lawn lovers order a pizza? Oh, Mike, back to the pizzas. What's up with that? I guess I miss being a pirate. Yo, ho, ho, and I'm a big dork. <laughs> but hey, at least I'm not breaking the rules. You did the right thing. I'm proud of you. We're proud of you, man. Yeah, Definitely, yo. Yeah. Anyway, I called my dad and told him about his car. After he got done yelling, he wrote Mr. Morgan a check. Now all I got to do is pay back my dad. Well, Mikey, it takes a big man to admit a mistake like that. Well, for example, take me. I ordered a pizza, yet I don't have any money to pay for it. <laughs> well, don't worry, because the pizza's on me. <laughs> okay, I got the camera so you can take a picture of me watching the... Is it Halloween again? <laughs> oh, uh, what do you see, Coach? Ah, oh, never mind, no time. Coach, it's almost here. Here. Oh, don't forget to get the good side. <laughs> All right, this is it. Get ready to be part of history. <laughs> Smile, Coach. No, 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 not yet. Ah, oh, <laughs> see. Oh, man, here's the comet. Oh, it looks just like oh, 
I got a good picture of you. See, you forgot to smile. A reading. Your word power. Well, check out these paradigms of vocabulary excellence. Sookie, sookie now. Ba, ba, ba. Guy talk. Fascinating. Need I say more? TNBC reads next weekend. We'll provide the dictionary.